Nigerians surround hotel where Tinobu is lodged in France attack his properties. It was reported that the former governor of Lagos State, Bola Ahmed Adekunle Tinobu, left the shore of Nigeria in a private jet late as of yesterday. Nigerians have since then bounced on his properties. Following reports that he had a hand in the Lekito Gates genocide of Tuesday night. While there haven't been any official reports to prove and disprove that report that he is out of the country, a recent video posted on Twitter showed some Nigerians in France surrounding the hotel he is currently reported to lodged it to be lodged in the crowd could be heard shouting shouting tinobu oli thief meanwhile some of his properties including the nation's newspaper tvc have been reportedly attacked he however denied any involvement in the massacre while stating that he has never earned a dime from the Lakers to gate. This is serious and that uh, it is so hot here in Nigeria, especially in legal states. Look at what Ahmed Tinobu has reportedly done or the steps he has taken after uh, uh you know the the massacre in the Lake to gates. Why did he leave the country immediately after uh, the incident happened? Why did he leave the country when others are, you know, busy uh, helping and uh, sharing in the pains of uh, the victims? Bola Ahmed Tinobu reportedly left the country and uh, went to France. Uh, the, the governor of Lagos State, even Obasanjo and ex-president, uh, spoken and uh, con uh, sent condolence uh, message to uh, the uh, the victims of the uh, Lekki attack. And now, Bola Med Tinobu has gone uh, to France, reportedly gone to France, to do what? And why did he leave to France when the country is hot? He is supposed to contest for the post of presidency in 2023. And now tell me, just tell me who will vote for him. When the country is hot and he's supposed to be there, he went to France. He reportedly went to France. Can we say he has a hand in what had happened, in what is happening in Lagos? Can we say uh, that... Um, he did something to this uh, youth or that uh, he has uh, he has a connection with the uh, soldiers army that have reportedly killed the masses in uh, Lake Ito Gate. Well, we still want to know how people feel about it. The Nigerians in France have gone to uh, the hotel, have reportedly gone to the hotel where uh Otinumbu lodged they want to know whether he is really there they want to know where, whether he, he is the one that is there or not they want to know and do something to him i know they will surely do something to him i know that you cannot run from your sins you cannot run from your guilt i stand to be corrected anyway whether he has a hand in it or not why did he travel out of uh, the country and that is why these people are after him the nigerians are shouting in uh, in france are shouting tinubu oli thief they want to see him there they want to know whether he's there and he must surely come out to see them he must come out at least he cannot be there forever. He will surely come out of the hotel. He does not want anybody to attack him. What about the family he left behind? Now, there was a report that his house, uh, his family house has been reached down. 
with fire. Uh, some of his properties, some of his business has been reportedly raised down with fire. Now, what will he be left with if people does not hear something about uh, what uh, his involvement rather in the in uh, what happened in Togate? They wouldn't be going after him. Is he the only one there? Is he the only one there? This man is a multi billionaire. A uh, man in Lagos, he owns most of the uh, properties in Lagos, and what does he want to gain? Killing innocent youths or having a hand in uh, the killings of the innocent youths, the leaders of tomorrow. What would they have done to him to deserve this treatment from them? And he has his own children whether they are in Nigeria or not. Nigeria is still their home, and there is nowhere they can go that can be like their home. Let's see people's opinions, see their contributions on what is happening here in Nigeria. This one said, you are seriously idiot. Is that what you can think of? Well, this one said, if he survives... Another one said, uh, you are a low-thinking human being for promoting a Siwaju for 2023. Well, he has ambition, uh, aspiration for uh, presidency in 2023. And, uh, well, we don't know who will vote him in. We don't know the people that are ready to vote him in whether uh, Nigerians will still fold their hands and watch the way things are going now and they, they will still know who to vote in. Uh, this one said, can somebody go and kill Tinobu's son and or daughter? Let him also feel the pain and also kill all his wife and children of the police or SARS. Let them... Uh, let them also feel what we are feeling. Well, this is not a time to revenge, but he also have to feel it if he has a hand in it. We cannot, you know, beat our chest now and say he has a hand in it. Though he is a, a godfather in Lagos. He is, he is a number one a godfather in Lagos. But what about all his children, sons and daughters, his wives? What do we do about them? That is what this person is saying, that uh, they should let him feel what the pain others are, others are facing. Another one said, he left Paris late last night again for Turkey. Why is he jumping from one place to another? Why is he, uh, you know... Are flying from one plane to another. Well, let's see, you know your thoughts, your views, your opinions on this new story. Drop your comments at the comment box. Thank you for listening, and I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.